Hard boiled eggs. I do find it the easiest job, you know, peeling a hard boiled egg often takes longer than you expect it to. It's the ultimate inconvenience food, the egg you can eat without bothering to boil it. But how do they end up out of their shell and ready for the shelves? How do you peel all of those eggs? Possibly they're peeled by hand, because I don't think we actually have a de-shilling machine. What's your best guess? Have you got an army of peelers? You best to roll them. Is that what they do in factories? That's what they do on the cooking program. Is it? <laughs> I'm on my way to find out how the pros crack the fiddly task of peeling a hard-boiled egg. I've come to a factory in Leicester where Pankaj Pancholi has spent the last 30 years perfecting his technique. You peel eggs for a living, don't you? That's all I do. That's all you do? Can yeah. you show me how you do it? You want to see it? I do. Come on, then. Come on, then. Lead the way. <laughs> right, so I'm excited about this. Well, <laughs> that's the first That's one. the first fun. Pankaj really is the egg man. As well as pre-peeled and hard-boiled, his eggs are also used in pies, scotch eggs, sandwiches and egg mayonnaise. We do about roughly round about between 1.2 to 1.5 million eggs a week. Wow, that is a lot. These look like your traditional eggs. These look like the eggs I sort of you get for breakfast in foreign countries. Yeah, well, these are eggs from Holland. They're barn eggs. OK. OK, these are British eggs, brown eggs. It's the species. It's a different type of hens laying different colours of eggs. That's all it is. Next, it's time for the fresh eggs to get hard-boiled. You're cooking them in individual little egg cups. That's right, it's a suction pan, just sucks 30 eggs on it. Yeah. This is the boiler. Yeah. Now, if you look at it, the eggs are very gently placed onto the conveyor. They're just getting placed in boiling water. You've got it. So, from there, fire it out slowly and gently, and it cooks. How long does the whole cooking process take? Between 18 to 20 minutes depending on the type of the eggs we're boiling. That's quite a long time. Yes, because it's very gentle and it's making sure the heat is penetrating slowly without damaging the eggs. I've always cooked my eggs in boiling water, but Pankaj finds the long cooking time at sub-boiling temperatures allows the middle of the egg to reach 85 degrees centigrade. This ensures the yolk is hard-boiled and any dangerous bacteria are killed off. Then it goes into what we call ourselves a high-risk area because then the eggs are fully cooked. Before I can inspect the cooked eggs, a quick costume change is needed. <laughs> Let me do it for you. High-risk area, here I come. So these are the cooked eggs. They are being dropped into this cooler, which is pre-chilled. It's vital the eggs are at just the right temperature before the all-important peeling process begins. We need to shrink the inner membrane slightly in there so we can get the shell off very quickly. If it's too cold, it won't do the job. If it's too hot, it won't do the job. Has to be right temperature. 11 degrees is optimum peeling temperature. And finally, the eggs are ready to enter the shelling machine. You can see the vibrating actions. They are on roller beds. Yeah. Basically, it is trapping the egg between the two rubbers. And it's just, just easily separating the shell and then it's just peeling the eggs like that. All right, all right, and that's what's going on in there. Yes, it's a very gentle process. And there you have it. Precise temperatures and careful timing are the secret to keeping the nation supplied with ready-to-eat hard-boiled eggs. We English people have a lot of capacity for hard-boiled eggs. Love an egg. <laughs> that is ecstatic. <laughs>